Hey all, Russ here, RVR TV. Good morning. How are you doing today? Today is Monday, Monday morning, January 28th. Gonna head over here to Tyson. I'm gonna fly the drone around like yesterday's video I showed it was the last day. Uh, well, I'll fly the drone twice, I think. First in the morning here, and then a little later uh, this afternoon. And you'll see how fast they tear down this big tent and this town empties out. It's amazing to see. Okay, let's make a left on Central and get busy. We got rain coming in too, they said, on the wet, uh, weather about midweek, which good timing. Most of the shows are over. Now, don't forget. The Arts and Crafts show starts February 1st, this coming Friday, here at Tyson Wells. So there's tons of sea. All the seasonal guys will still be here. Uh, Desert Gardens, uh, vendors on Main Street, all them guys are still here selling. So just because the big tent's gone uh, doesn't mean that there's nothing to do here. There's a ton to do. Okay, we'll make a right. This is Kewen Street. Straight across is Prospectors. Now, uh, they'll still be open. Most of their vendors for a while. And on the right, you see those metal buildings there at Tyson. Those are the rock guys now. They head on to Tucson, but other vendors will be setting up right there. On the left is the seasonal market. And all the street vendors on the right will few of them will change out, but they'll still be there as well. Okay, pull in here, get parked. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to run out back. I'll uh, launch a drone. We'll get some aerial shots, and I shall return. We go... Okay, it's roughly 9 o'clock. 9 o'clock Monday morning. Most of the vendors I've talked to said they did pretty decent. That's looking straight down. Okay, now here's Tyson Wells. See the empty spots are already tearing down in there. And then he turns uh, that section back into his RV park. Now some of these vendors stay, but they move to a different location. You can see the parking lot's empty. They'll move up closer to the street for the last show. Better parking, more exposure. But look how empty it is. For the last 10 days, this place has been packed by this time. Wash is all empty. Swing around. Okay, there's your big tent. Looking emptier, huh? Get a little closer here. See, most of the outside guys are tearing down. The food guys are gone. That striped roof, that's that guy out of Redlands does all the RV repair. Now remember this shot because it'll look different this afternoon. Okay, from a little higher up. Flying roughly about 200 feet. Look out in the desert. You can see Rice Ranch here. They're thinning out. Now this thing only closed at 3 o'clock yesterday. Now look out at La Posa West. Look how thin that's getting. Alrighty, there's your early morning look. That tent will go down in a hurry. I bet by tomorrow, Tuesday, that thing will be on the ground. Look at all them RVs that got to move, too. Yeah. There's a huge cost in moving all those things, too. See me straight down? See the van? Okay, let me get landed. Okay, I just seen this 
They're tearing this one down. This is across the street here at Tyson. That's the guy that was selling all the LED lights and awnings. He actually hires a company to set up that tent. A lot of these guys do that. The bigger vendors don't have people set it up for them. And all these guys, the food guys are leaving. They're all tearing down this morning. This will all be uh, back into his RV park here by tomorrow, usually Wednesday. Takes a lot. There's someone packing up right there on the right. Show's over. But some of them are staying, they're just moving to a different spot. See the food court? They're all gone, all the trailers. Those guys pe peel out pretty quick. Of course, all they gotta do is hook on their trailer and go. Forgot the rice machine. <laughs> okay, moving on. They're empty. You know, people, when this is all over, they come around and search the parking lot for drop stones and beads. You'll see that quite often. That guy's all cleaned out and ready to move. He probably had that tent set up for him. See, they're all packing up. Now, the closer we get to the street, those guys will stay. Look like this bungee cord guy, he's cleaning up. Right, we'll walk over here through the seasonal. A lot of people came through here. And still will. I mean, it's not over at all. All these guys on this side are still set up, ready for business. And most of them will stay through the end of March. Like K&B, he never tears down, I think about the third week of March. I don't know about the tool guy here on the right. Beer bellies will stay open for at least another month or so. Then uh, Serene, the dress shop here, she stays open. Pet patio, they'll stay open. And the people sell the knives and the taser guns. Almost all of these guys will stay here. At least till March. Look at all the leather jackets there. That's cool. And the grocery store guy. He'll be here. That's a big tent they have in here. That's a lot of area. They take up. A ton of food goes out of there. Cheap. Buy cheap. Eat quite a bit for a long time. They also have uh, drugstore items in there too. There's pet patio opening up. Well, good morning. Morning. Well, it looks like one empty. That ain't much. Okay, well, I'm going to come back about 3, 4 o'clock this afternoon and launch the drone. And we'll check out see what it looks like from the air then I got a few other things I got a bunch of editing now this week you will see areas like the powwow uh, the gold detector show and that kind of stuff that I filmed but never got edited that's gonna come out this week too so I got a ton of editing and catch up to do so I'm gonna go do that I'll be back out here in a few hours fly the drone and See you then. We go. Welcome back. 
Look at the clouds. They're rolling in. Now check this out. Look at the big tent. They're all gone. All the vendors are gone. The parking lot's empty. And they've already got the sides off the big tent. That thing will be laying on the ground tomorrow. I bet they have it all packed up and out of here by Wednesday. I'll come back out and fly tomorrow. But check it out. Look. They're tearing the whole thing down. All the vendors are gone. Everyone's gone. RV dealer's still there. And he'll probably stay set up for a week or two. But they'll start moving them out. But look. It's exactly 24 hours since it closed. And that's how fast that goes away. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> and swing over here to Tyson. And look, they're all gone out there too. Still more to go. but And the car's parked down there. They're shopping. But you can see it. See how it thins out? And by tomorrow, that'll all be back into an RV park. That's what it looks like 24 hours after everything closes down from the big tent. Fly a little closer. Get you a little better shot. There, you'll see all the RVs come back. Now those big setups here right on the street, they'll stay through the end of the third show. There it is. There's Tyson Wells, and that will be the Arts and Crafts show right there starting this Friday. And it'll be new vendors setting up, plus a lot of the older ones. I shouldn't say older. Existing. <laughs> Whatever. Look back over. One more look. Look at the desert thinning out. They be gone. And that tent will be on the ground. I'll guarantee you by tomorrow. I'll fly the drone. Unless the weather gets them. But they'll load that thing up quick. There's a great look at Kewen. You can see Central Avenue's back to normal. Great look at uh, Quartzsite. There's Holiday Palms, 88 Shades, B10 Campground. Way down there is the Downtown District. Community of Q Mountain, and there's Q Mountain. Wasn't that video cool about seeing the view from up there? There's Tyson Wash. That's it. Show's over for the Big Ten. Alrighty. There you seen it. I'll be flying around out here all week with the drone, be all over the place. Like I said, I have other videos I'm going to be putting out. The powwow, where they had the gold detector club and that kind of thing. Plus more, I'll be filming also the start of the arts and crafts show. Alright, this is Russ signing off now. Hope everyone has a great day. Don't forget to travel safe. Talk soon. Take care.